Yo, so I wanted to make this video because I think I've created a very, very potent weed. Well, I didn't really create it. I know there's probably fucking been thousands of other people out there that have done shit like this, similar to it. Um, but I always talk about in my videos, I've reviewed a lot of Hemp Masters. Sorry if I look fucking red. It's Florida. It's always fucking hot here. But um, I always talk about how, you know, how Hemp Masters are poor quality control. Like, obviously, this is the normal Hemp Master. Comes on. Um, they come in the package, but their fucking carts break off all the damn time. Like it just pops off. There's like barely any glue holding it on. And then here, I'll show you guys. There's literally just a little fucking wire. You have to poke through this little hole and then hope for the best that like, well, however much, uh, distillate you had, you could still hit out of it. Um, well, I was fucking fed up cause this is like the fourth or fifth time that like, these little hemp masters bitches break. So I was like, all right, I'm just gonna put, mix, like pour as much of it as I can into this green box card I already had and see what's the best. And the creation, I don't know what you'd really call it, but man, dude, am I fucked up. Like, I'm gonna hit it for y'all just because this shit fucking rips. It's a big ass green box. But it was fucking, um, uh, awesome because you saw it kind of reminded me of like when you mix vape juice I poured um, the clear ass Delta 8 distillate it was the runt hit master into the green box and it was like the clear mixing with like the dark and then it yeah it's still dark ass uh, distillate I don't know if y'all be able to see that um, I didn't want to put a much a lot into this because I didn't know how it was gonna end up tasting but Guys, this shit's fire. I definitely think you guys, if you guys smoke a shit, will like this fucking thing. And I remember I saw um, a video a while back talking about Delta 10. And I don't really know if this is would be considered Delta 10 or what really Delta 10 is. I know um, there was that all, all cannabinoid shit like, that I got when I was out in Tennessee. I don't know if that's Delta 10. There's so much new crazy shit going on in the weed industry nowadays. Like, fucking intrigues me, guys. Like, I just like smoking, whether it's Delta 8, Delta 9, Delta 10. Like, fuck it, bro. I like all of it. Um, I get down with all of it. And I definitely do recommend, like, trying a little bit of Delta 9, a little bit of Delta 8. I know a few weeks ago I had some flour. And I still had my, I was just hitting my cart like I, as I normally do. And I really like the high because like you get like a really good body high, but it also really mellows your brain. Like I know people when they do Delta 8, they get like very, very tired and stuff and groggy um, right off the bat. I think it's good like mixing the two. Um, I just really enjoy the effects of it. So yeah, this is kind of my experience is like talking about how I do both or like mixing the both. Um, but yeah, if you guys are into smoking and shit, I definitely recommend. Or if you guys like ever do are in a, stuck in an experience like I am, because um, I know there's I'm not the only person out there that like smokes both. Like I, I enjoy like some days, some weeks I might only want to smoke Delta Nine. Like it's so cool uh, being in a state where it's so easily accessible, even though it's like not federally like legal. Um, well, Delta Eight is, but Delta Nine, it's like there's so many dispensaries out here nowadays that like it basically is legal and the thing is people don't talk about like with delta 8 being legal it smells the fucking same like if i'm smoking a pre-roll from higher up outside like this mall right down the road from me like no cop is going to know that it's delta 8 like it's go like and it's so kind of mainstream here nowadays too like you go anywhere and you smell pot it's fucking awesome um yeah, I just don't, I don't really understand why it's not fully legal with the, how easily access, I mean, for fuck's sake, I can go buy fucking Delta 8 pre-rolls at the wall wall right here, like, it's not like it's that hard to get weed out here, um, anyways, I just wanted to wrap the video guys up, definitely, uh, leave your comment down below, your thoughts, um, if you guys have done some similar shit like this, uh, new strains you want to talk, uh, this Cali Bloom, I do want to review the other flavors, because this is like easily been my favorite like delta 8 dispo i found like it's way better than that one treetop i reviewed 
It's way better than those fucking hit masters. And I'm not saying those hit masters or any of that shit's bad. It's just this thing. It's same price. Um, the actual like distillate seems a lot thicker. So like, I've been like, I've had a couple people chief on this. Like I know obviously stay safe COVID and shit, but I've had some people chief on this, and.